Hey, welcome back to the homestead. It's a uh, windy but very sunny day out here in uh, towards the end of February. Um, so I'm just out here at the uh, compost pile and I'm gonna be doing some work with the compost today. Um, attempting to get it to reactivate and finish off so we can use it in the spring and summer garden. All right, so here's one of the piles and uh, I've got the thermometer in there and it's right about 100. Um, which on the meter there it says steady um, so there's steady active and hot on there and active is around 120 and hot is like 140 and over um, so this pile is like kind of it's actually pretty progressed along um, but it's not quite where it needs to be and I actually added some fresh grass clippings to it recently and that's what got it back hot uh, or at least to the uh, 100 degree range because before that both my piles had cooled off um, just to room temperature, you know, or ambient temperature outside. So here's the other pile. This is the one that was been covered. And uh, this one is also, this is down at like 80. Right? Let me check. So this is the one that was covered. Um, and this one's pretty, progressed pretty far along. It's like probably half finished, I would guess. But yeah, it's down to about 80. It's not very hot. So... What I'm gonna do today is combine those two piles in this middle bay here. Um, this has, has some food scraps and stuff, so I'm gonna move this stuff out of here. But yeah, I'm gonna combine those two piles in the middle and add a bunch of grass clippings throughout and uh, see if we can get this pile to get up to 140 or real hot and, and stay hot. Um, so yeah, just trying to get this, this piles heated up and finished off. So. That's the plan. Um, now I'm gonna cut off some, cut some grass out there in the field and yeah, start moving it over. So what I've done here is put some grass on the bottom and then layered on some of this pile and um, then I'm going to put more grass. But first I want to show you, here's the inner workings of this pile. Um, yeah, it's gone along pretty well. All that green is fresh grass I put in about a week ago. Um, so it is breaking down, it's near finished. A lot of those corn stalks I'd put in there are disappeared um, and broken down. So. This is good, I think this will be the final push to get it really close to done. Um, it's pretty moist because I've been watering it. Um, smell, uh, the outside of it wasn't too bad, but as we got into the middle, it started to smell a little more, but not that bad. So just gonna keep layering in, um, and yeah, layering in grass and compost. All right, so this is the new pile. Um, just layered in grass and both those other piles, this is, a lot bigger of a pile which I think is going to be a good thing because a bigger pile gets hotter and stays hotter longer. Um, I do have a prediction I think it might start stinking because it's really wet and a lot of it was pretty wet and it's already loaded down with like some nitrogen materials but uh, I just want it to get really hot so that it'll finish up. Um, so anyways we're gonna check it out over the next few days and just see uh, see where it goes from here and see how hot it gets. And I didn't even use all that grass, so that was like one cart full of grass. So if you have any ideas for me what to do with the extra grass, if you have any ideas, let me know. Drop them in the comments box. Um, I'll see you in a day or two, and we'll check the heat. All right, so day two, and we are sitting steady at about 95 um, 92 to 95, so this is good. Uh, we'll check back in another day. All right, so day three here, and we're just steady at 100 degrees. So, 
We did get heated up on this, but uh, not quite to what I wanted to. It's basically stabled off around 100, and we were hoping for 120 plus, really 130, 140. So uh, this little experiment is over. Um, I think maybe next time add more grass, like really layered in thick. Um, I layered it in in multiple layers, so it was, you know, grass, compost, grass, compost, grass, compost. But I think I would just go even thicker with the grass. So this little experiment's done for now. I don't think I'm going to, um, you know, go redo this or anything. I'm just going to let this stuff finish off because it is close enough to finished. Um, it's getting pretty close, so I'm just going to let it finish off. Let's, let's take a look at it. So yeah, it is, it is pretty close to finished. But I just I wanted to get wanted it to get real hot and fully just cook and finish quick. But it smells good. It smells basically like nothing like soil. So it's close enough to done. I'm just gonna let it finish out and hopefully it'll be done. You know, another month or two, ready for the spring summer season. So make sure to subscribe, like the video, give us a big thumbs up, all that. And uh, thanks for watching this one, and we'll see you next time.